If you see this, you can't wear a shirt for two days. Hmm, this seems to be just some dumb gacha kid who thinks they're slick. Well, newsflash, they're not, because if you're a girl, you can just wear a dress or a sports bra. God forbid you will show your shoulders and the teachers send you home, but they can just go to Garbage Island. And if you're a dude, just wear a jumper or a sweater. We're dealing with children here. They literally have the IQ of a nine-year-old. Okay, bro, where do I even begin? This dude, let's just get it out the way, looks terrifying. I don't even know what you're trying to do. I don't know if you're trying to look cute, but your hand looks like a flipper, you know, like a dolphin fin, something like that. Get in the bin. Like, what was the story of this even meant to be? They're in school, posing, I guess. She runs away over here, and then they're just looking at her like this. His pose makes me uncomfortable. Even the shirt slightly undone makes me uncomfortable. This whole video makes me uncomfortable. I am not angry. I am in pain. And you put me here. You. The person who's supposed to love me more than anything. Was that? I think it's the sound of no one caring. Yeah, I I'm gonna be honest here. <laughs> no one's gonna see this and be like, damn, that hit me in the feels. God damn. But guys, in all seriousness, if you're going through some tough times, because I get it, I get a lot of DMs about it, just remember that everything is going to be okay. Problems which might seem huge now in your life, you'll probably look back at them in a few years and laugh. I mean, I'm not the best with words, but yeah, all I'm gonna say is, you know, you're gonna be okay. Trust. Forced to be gay. Hmm, I don't really know how you can force someone to be something they're not. I mean, how would I do it though? I'm gonna use this Spongebob reference to show you guys how I'd get the message across. Okay, I'll try. Gary, you are gonna be gay. You've got the big gay, Gary, and you are gonna like it. I just want to remind everyone in the LGBTQ, I am never making fun of any of you. I honestly love you guys. It's actually a privilege to have such a strong LGBTQ viewer base. You guys are all just really nice and awesome, and it's just nice for me to know that you all know that I'm joking when I say stuff like this. I am in pain! But welcome back, Gamer Virgins, King Simp Milkman Ben here. Today we are looking at r slash gacha life cringe. Remember, not all the gacha community is bad, so please don't harass anyone because they enjoy it. There are some good creators out there. Remember to like and subscribe on the video, comment your favourite moment, as it helps me out a lot and it's free, so it costs you absolutely nothing to do, and you can leave whenever you want. With that being said, enjoy the milk. I am in pain! But moving on though, I, I received something which I, I don't really know how to feel. A gamer virgin made me some fan art, I think. And I say I think because I don't know if this was made specifically for me, or it, it was just meant to be what I'm like. I, I, re I really don't know, but Abby on Twitter tagged me in it, so... Thank you, Abby. Here is a fan art video for It's Ben 95 Follow me, by the way. It's him destroying Gacha Heat. I, I know it says fan art, but you will see why I don't know if this was made for me or <laughs> it was just what I'm like. I'm going to narrate what I think is going on, though. Okay, so it starts off with me having a scythe for some reason of all weapons. I have a scythe, and I assume this little goblin thing is Gacha Heat. I mean, when I was watching this, I was like, this isn't really very accurate to what I'm like. But when it got to this part, I was like, wow, this is this is very accurate. Because a lot of people say I'm like Anakin Skywalker from Star Wars. Even though I don't look like him, it's mainly because I just love killing children. <laughs> Oh, oh my god. <laughs> oh, this is my favorite part. I throw the sword. <laughs> I think this is meant to be. And obviously the kids are running as they should because the Simp King Milkman It's Ben is here. But they just shrink into nothing. I mean, man, this... 
This is this is high budget, goddamn. So yeah, that's that's pretty much it. I mean, it just kind of ends with me, I guess, waking up from a nap, as you do, just a, a nice dream, it must have been, of me just casually spaghettiing gacha cringe kids. And then it's just like, or, or was I even dreaming at all? But yeah, guys, believe it or not, when I'm not responding to DMs or tweets, I'm not walking around in my spare time with a scythe or a sword, just taking out gacha cringe kids. I mean... <laughs> It was, it was pretty funny, so be sure to go give Abby some love on Twitter. Me drinking half the milk in the fridge. Me knowing I'm going to be an alcoholic when I'm older. Yes, the obvious correlation between milk and drinking alcohol is obviously going to lead to that. How did I never see it before? I actually don't even know what to say. Why make this? What was, what was this for? And who made this and thought they did a good job? It's not even something which is usually targeted, you know, like fizzy drinks. It's it's just milk. Milk will ruin your future, apparently. Man, yeah, he is so hot, especially when he gives you that look because he wants to eat your face. This one's just captioned as WTF, and it's just a straight in a lesbian school. Oh, oh no, how will she survive? A straight girl in a school full of lesbians. The absolute horror. Watch out, females of the LGBTQ. We all know your spaghetti cheese bandits who want to hump anything that you're attracted to. But if you could just control yourselves at this poor girl in this school, good, <laughs> could, could, could be okay. That would be great. Thanks. I've, I've just actually noticed that she's saying you. Like, <laughs> okay, this... This is just wrong on so many levels. And by the way, I just want to specify that I am joking. I don't want to see It's Ben cancelled because he said lesbians were spaghetti cheese bandits who want to get it on with anything that they're attracted to. Come on. Yeah, I'm joking. <laughs> this channel is all jokes. No, you aren't gay or straight if you like more than one gender. You are one of the sexuality that are interested in more than one gender. Okay. Let's check this out. Will you be my owner? Okay, his name is Sam. Sexuality gay, sometimes straight. Makes sense. How can people even think like this? Sexuality isn't some roll of the dice. Monday I'm straight, Tuesday I'm gay. It doesn't work like that. Shut up. Almost forgot the question, actually. Will you be my owner? Hmm. No. Does anyone want to own Sam? Didn't think so. I will I will honestly make a petition to make Gacha cringe kids go outside and touch grass because they've clearly never left the bathtub because they stink. <laughs> As that is probably the most child-friendly thing I have said in a long time. That someone stinks. Wow, you know, I'm changing. The Gacha cringe in this video personally hasn't been too bad. It's been enjoyable to actually look at it today and have a good laugh. But I hope you Gamer Virgins enjoyed it. Thank you for the continued support on the channel. 400,000 subscribers. That is that is crazy. <laughs> Still, you know, thank you. I hope you all have a wonderful day and I will see you all next time.